God bless you, my brothers and sisters. This is Pastor Robert L. Carpenter II, interim pastor at New Salem Missionary Baptist Church of Tampa, located in beautiful Temple Terrace, Florida. It's the weekend of Sunday, April 8th, 2018. Let's see what's happening now. My, 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 what a time we had on Resurrection Sunday. We started at 6 a.m. Uh, speaking over at Rebirth Baptist Church for their sunrise service. And then at 7 a.m., we had our worship on the green and Reverend Martin preached the dynamic message as the sun rose over the horizon. And then we had our community breakfast and then our Sunday school and Easter presentations. And then at 11 o'clock, the Lord blessed the choir sang, the people came, the people worshiped, we shared the word, and another soul was added to the kingdom of God. We thank God that the Lord added to the church daily, such as should be saved. God is doing things here at New Salem Missionary Baptist Church. You ought to be here, get here when you can. Every Sunday, 10 a.m., we'll see you soon. New Salem family, it is with godly sorrow that we share with you the transition from earth to glory of our dear saintly mother, Sister Florie Griggs. She went home to be with the Lord peacefully uh, this past week, and we definitely want you to remember the Billups and Griggs family in your prayers. The arrangements have been entrusted to Ray Williams Funeral Home. The wake will be on Friday evening, the 13th, and then also the homegoing celebration will be Saturday, April 14th at 2 p.m. right here at New Salem Missionary Baptist Church with the viewing at 1 p.m. prior to the funeral. The Bible says to be absent from the bodies, to be present with the Lord. We know by her testimony and by her life, Mother Griggs is there with the Lord. Please pray for the family, and we will see you real soon. I want to share with you out of 1 Chronicles 12, verse 32, where it talks about the sons of the men of Issachar and how they were understanding of the times so they could tell Israel what to do, so Israel would know what to do. After Easter, there's another significant celebration in time that uh, comes 50 days after Easter, 50 days after Resurrection Sunday, and we call it Pentecost. The word Pente means 50, 50 days after Easter. That is the birth of the church as we know it today. Now there's something significant that we must see here in Acts chapter two. It says that when the day of Pentecost had fully come, they were all with one accord in one place and suddenly, and that's when the Holy Spirit came down and filled the house as a mighty rush of wind where they were sitting. And then we saw the move of God that which birthed the church. Understand while they were sitting there in that room, they were praying, they were praising, and they believed God for the promise of the Holy Spirit to come there where they were. So what we're doing here at New Salem Missionary Church in Tampa, we are doing 50 days of prayer, praise, and power. 50 days each day. Each one of our members will be praying at least 15 minutes a day for the needs of the church, for the needs of our community, for the needs of our country, for the needs of the world. And so we've known we've had this little prayer guide and devotional that each day we'll be praying at least 15 minutes, all on one accord. Believe in God that just as the church was birthed on the day of Pentecost, there are promises, there are blessings and things that are going to be birthed in our lives personally, in our church corporately, and even in your life anywhere in the world. I thank God for this opportunity to share this with you. If you'd like a copy of this prayer guide to join us in this, you can just go to our Facebook page, New Salem Missionary Baptist Church of Tampa. Find us there, email us, and contact us, and we will get that out to you in a PDF file. God bless you. I'm believing God that we're going to have prayer, praise, and power in Jesus' name. Springtime brings new times. That's right. Starting Sunday, April 8th, we move our service times. 8.30 will be Sunday school. And then at 9.50, we'll prepare in prayer and meditation for our worship service. And then at 10 a.m. properly, we will have our morning worship celebration. One service for everybody to come and worship together in the beautiful holy. Starting Sunday, April 8th. We'll see you there.
My brothers and sisters, I'm looking forward to April 16th through the 18th, where we're having a spring homecoming revival and music workshop. Our speakers for that will be Pastor Reggie Edwards of Greater Mount Pleasant Baptist Church in Callahan, Florida, near Jacksonville, and Mr. Corey P. Edwards, founder and director of the Florida Fellowship Super Choir. It's going to be a wonderful time of praise and worship and the word. Won't you join us each night at 7 p.m.? We'll see you there. God bless you, my brothers and sisters. I'm looking forward to next Sunday, April 8th, when you join Reverend Martin and I for Pizza with the Pastor, sponsored by Five Star Pizza in the uh, USF area. Join us after service, our 10 a.m. worship, where we sit down and we're going to get to know each other, have some great fellowship, and reach out to each other on a more personal level. Join us next Sunday, Reverend Martin and I for Pizza with the Pastor. Hey there, before you go, why don't you like this video if you're enjoying this? Also subscribe right down there, subscribe so you can receive this video automatically each week and then I need you to share with three or four people in your social media stream. Let them know what's happening here at New Salem Missionary Baptist Church of Tampa where prayer is our priority. Save the date, Saturday, June 9th, 2018 at 6 p.m. It's the best Western showdown. Come dress in your best Western theme attire for an evening of fun, food and fashion. Get your ticket soon, sponsored by the General Home Missions Ministry.